Good afternoon, Keitha. January 1st right now is the projected start date for the new superintendent. In between now and then, the school board will hold multiple community meetings, collecting input on the search, and they will also begin to advertise nationwide for the position. Now, I sat in on the school board meeting held this morning, and they were joined by members from the Florida School Boards Association to start the second stage of the superintendent search process. They released a draft timeline today. Between August through September, the board will release an online public survey and hold four in-person and two online community meetings to get input on the search. Then from September to October, applications will go live and candidates will start to be reviewed by the board. Now I had a chance to talk with board chair Dr. Kelly Coker, who says the applications will be open for 30 days. For some reason we get in the middle of it and need to extend it we might we're hopeful we won't have to we are the 20th largest district in the country a lot of people already know that we're open and we're excited about finding our new leader so i'm hopeful we'll do it for 30 days and we'll get to move through this process real quickly the board will hold um conduct interviews with finalists from october to November and they do hope to have a finalist selected by the end of November. December will be a transition period and again that start date right now projected for January 1st. This timeline is subject to change and they will hold multiple meetings to address this timeline and make sure they are heading in the right direction. Reporting in Jacksonville, Tia Collins, First Coast News on your side.